that set a few things up. What's up? All right, cool. I'm gonna take one AirPod out because that sounds crazy. Um, hello everyone. Welcome to The Bachelorette and Claim to Fame Live. I'm going to be adding everybody here in a second, so bear with me. All right, you ready? Here we go. I'm gonna be searching for people's names. Here we go. Here we go. Let me get my good brother Franklin on here first. I have to actually search for people. Here we go. Are you joining? Invite. Now. Next. I'm very excited to be doing this. We're all huge Bachelor, Bachelorette fans. So this is a big one. Uh... Why is this not coming up? One second, everyone. I am working on it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Press to join. Accept. See you. All right, here we go. Hold on. Slowly but surely here. Hi. Hello. Hello. How are you doing? Thanks for having me. I'm good. Thank you for both joining us. Are we going to, are you guys going to be on one screen? Is that going to be the easiest way to do it? Yeah, yeah, probably, right? Perfect. All right, I'm going to try to get Frankie here. Hold on one moment. Go, go. Buy one, get one. <laughs> My brother, he's actually in the other room, so if this doesn't work, he'll join us. But hello. <laughs> hello. Thanks for having us. We're so excited. Are you kidding? This is amazing. We are, this is uh, a dream come fans. true for me. This is great. <laughs> For um, I, you should have came on our season. I know. <laughs> you know the way that Kevin and I are like times. the biggest Bachelor Nation. Like you don't, you don't get it. This is. Uh, amazing. How much Oops. <laughs> no, we're so excited. I feel like yeah. I'm right now. I mean, one of I my know. first concerts. Brothers, so. Just saying. Strong, I'm strong. I like it. Thank God, full circle. It really is. As a fan of the show, I feel like I should like set this up for everyone. So anyone that doesn't know already, this is a big, big year for uh, The Bachelorette, right? Because you guys are doing it together. Is that correct? Can you explain it to me? Because I, I want to make sure I understand fully. Yeah, I feel like that's been the big question everyone's been wanting to know. So there'll be just one bachelorette dating 30, but now we have two bachelorettes dating 32, 32. guys. They put in two oh. extra. <laughs> Way that didn't get complicated, though. Like... I know. I mean, you, we didn't really know what to plan for because it's for, you know, we kind of paved the way in that sense, but. Rachel and I always talk about how we have great communication and great friendships. So I think keeping that in our minds really helped guide us in a great way. That's, that's probably cool, though, too, at the same time. Like, you kind of had you had your friend with you along for the ride. At the same time, like, you kind of got insight one way or the other, like, kind of quickly on people. You got, like, a second opinion quickly, maybe, too. Did that help ever? Exactly. We always, when you date someone normally, you always go in about it so yeah. we were able to this time like have a conversation go tell guests how it went how mm -hmm. it was feeling yeah it was yeah it sounded That's bored awesome. we did meet the same men so mm -hmm. as we were talking about it we both had references mm -hmm. so that too Oh, that's wonderful. Well, we are so excited to do this. So they gave me like this whole sheet of paper to keep us on track here. So like, I'm going to do my best to, since we're now the new host of this show that comes on after your show, we're so excited about. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you guys also have a big premiere. Yeah, we're so excited. The night's um, the night. You want to hear No, I mean, we Yeah, they love that. Yeah. Frankie, take it away. I, I don't have that sheet. You have that sheet. No, no, no. Tell oh. us about the show that we're doing. Oh, you tell us about, about the show. That. They cut out. I'm, I'm sorry. Yeah. I, I apologize. No, I mean, the show, we, 
basically imagine 12 people, right? Everybody's related to someone that you love, adore, someone famous. You put them in a house and then you make everyone lie about who they are and keep a secret of who their celebrity relative is from each other. And then at the end, if you can keep your secret, you might win $100,000. It's- uh, That's yeah. true. I can imagine anyone making it to the end. There's no way. <laughs> It, it's you, you are you will be shocked um it's amazing to see that there are people you think like there is no chance that i that you are not related to x and they are not related to that they're related to somebody completely different they were able to keep their story intact it's really cool it's crazy i mean the way that kevin and i whole time I mean, every week we're coming in with 10 guesses for every person. And then every time we find out, we're completely yeah. wrong. There was maybe like one I knew it in the entire show. Yeah. God, I was going to ask. I can't, I, but then again, I don't know if that has more to do with us or the clues. So <laughs> it was awesome. We could do just you be guys, really stupid. Do you, now, do you guys have any claim to fame like that? Like someone that's super famous that you're slightly related to or related to? Grandpa John. Grandpa John. <laughs> I think that's Those too tangible. Yeah. yeah. But they are, they're famous now. They're they famous. are. Um, has, have, has Grandpa John been getting any dates? Apparently that's a big deal. Since um, er yeah. Well, he is 83. <laughs> we mm -hmm. love him. Hey, man. And so. I think enjoying his retirement life. I mean, he has a bigger social life than any of us he's always bridge he had to interrupt his bridge game to go on a podcast and they waited for him i'm like <laughs> like 80 year old problems so well that that is that is that's important bridge is a huge huge thing in most people's lives so i totally get it yeah so what are you guys doing for the premiere tonight well here we are we're yeah. here at jimmy kimmel mm -hmm. nice so nice Mm -hmm. And then we'll be watching it together tonight. So it's awesome that we're going to be together for the premiere because we won't always. Yeah. I mean, I just can't wait for everyone to see it. We're so mm -hmm. excited. And I mean, it's just going to be so different from what anyone. We're really ready. Yeah. We're really... All right. Well, we, we need to know as fans of the show. Okay. So you have to spill a little bit of tea and we need to know, is there a little bit of crazy dating stories that happened while out? Is, was there any, not, you don't have to give anything away. I understand we have to keep things secret too, but like, yeah, we're, on is the there same, any, we're on the same team. Yeah, is there, <laughs> was there moments in the show that we're going to just be like, Oh God, what is happening? Oh my gosh. I feel um, like just all the time. Yeah, like if me and Gabby are on <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. You better buckle up. I mean, we have the big, in Bachelor history. Mm -hmm. yeah. Of course, it's going to be crazy when there's that many guys on a date. they have never been done before, so mm -hmm. truly nobody knew what to prepare for. With real people in real time, things get messy and go awry. You really can't predict people. So I think you'll see a lot of that and how, like, kind of reactions to new and yeah. how people, how how the new layout changes on both sides. The, the, the yeah, because the guys, I mean, they have no idea what to do. Right. We had no idea to get out at the same Right. Time. Obviously, yeah. it's just, you know, crazy. But mm -hmm. everyone's just going to kind of watch us all figure it out yeah. in real time. Yeah. That's I mean, great. You're getting me so yeah. excited right now. Yeah, for sure. No, we're definitely excited about it. Uh, me and my wife, uh, we're about to celebrate our 13 years of marriage, which is incredible. Um, so we are huge fans. It is definitely our, you know, our guilty pleasure. We sit down, we watch it. We actually watch it when I'm on tour traveling. We watch it from afar. Like I'll literally like, we'll like wait to watch it together. And then um, oh sadly, we got the spoiler of your last season together while we were up and we were like, this is horrifying. We both saw it in different times and we were like, did you see the spoiler? She was like, yes, I did. I'm, I am so mad. So we're just happy that we have a new season coming out. I, I have a very weirdly similar story. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have to know. I do have a little fun game we can play before we all have to get back to what we got going on. Um, 
One of the things we do in the first episode of our show, we play two truths and a lie. Are you guys down to play? Oh, totally. totally. I love a good game. Okay, cool, 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 cool. So we'll, we'll, we'll go first, and then you tell us which one you think is a truth and a lie, and then we'll have you go as well. Sound good? Yeah, yeah. perfect. All right, Franklin, please take it away. You can take the first one. Okay, I, uh, I played professional. I, uh, I boxed for two years, and um, I was the elected president of my uh, K-12 to school. Oh, I can see you playing Tetris. I'm going with boxing. Yeah. Boxing the lie? Yeah. Yeah. No, unfortunately, I actually did do that, but I was the vice president of my Ah. Dude, you got the only way to win two truths and a lie. You can't tell. Hyper Pacific, yeah. (laughs) So subtle. I'm trying to think of mine. It's not going to (laughs) be. It's all right. I'll I'll go give you a little more time. All right, so uh, two truths and a lie. I am... (laughs) from a place called Wyckoff, New Jersey. I have performed for four different presidents and we mm-hmm. have new music that we're finishing right now. Um, well, are you, wait, Frankie, are, are you guys from New Jersey? Yes or no? <laughs> yes. Some yes, of us are from New, from New Jersey. <laughs> President. Mm-hmm. Presidents, okay, yeah, it's three, not four. Oh, oh we got oh, it. Nicely done. Humble brag. <laughs> I was aging myself just a touch if it was like multiple. Um, all right, so now go ahead. Okay, I got one. <laughs> okay, I was born in Florida. I was there in college and I've hiked a volcano in Asia. Oh, uh, I can't guess this because I think I know. It's the <laughs> second one. <laughs> I would say second number one? two. Yeah, number two. No, so I, I wasn't born in Florida. I was ah. born in Florida. Yeah. Oh, uh, Fair <laughs> enough. <laughs> We lost. All right. <laughs> oh no. Um, okay. Um, I've been dancing since I was two. I have lived the last ten years in Colorado and I'm one of two current bachelorettes. <laughs> Colorado is not correct, if I remember your yeah. season. Is that right? You're wrong, yeah. <laughs> Man, yeah, it's rusted, dude. Rusted. I know. We 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 need to we need to um, educate ourselves a little bit great, for, further. Well, congratulations, guys. We're so I know. I know. I know. I need to... We are going to be watching ourselves this evening. So thank you. Um, thanks for doing this with us. It's really cool. I'm literally freaking out. I'm so glad I got to meet you guys. Good luck. Oh, we're so excited to watch. We're so. Oh, thank you. To hear well, me. we will be watching the whole time because, uh, you know, it's going to be a fun night on Mondays on ABC. So thanks, everybody. And thanks, everyone, for tuning in. Enjoy Bye. your night and good luck on Jimmy Kimmel. Bye, Bye guys. Thank you. Bye, guys. Have a great night. Congrats. Thank you.